Sherry English with Dynamic Directions, here to talk to you about how the flow of any given project gets implemented. And I'm gonna use mountain climbing as an analogy. Many of you know I like to hike, and, and so this is the analogy I like to use. At first, we're in the brainstorming phase. And as the leader, you might see 15 mountains that you think your team ought to climb. So you're brainstorming, you're considering who is your team, what are your resources, where are you headed? What's the next mountain that makes sense for y'all to conquer? So that's phase one. Which mountain are we going to pick? Which mountain makes sense for us, our team, and where we're going? Next step then is consolidating on that mountain. It's looking around at everyone and saying, we all agree this mountain is what we need. This is the mountain we need to conquer. Everybody's on board for this mountain. It's not Kilimanjaro, it's not Denali, it's Mount Everest. That's the one we're climbing. Yes, that's the one we're climbing. Now then everybody's on page, we've done our brainstorming, we've selected the one that fits us best. Phase three is going to be how do we climb that particular mountain? What routes are we going to take? What training do we need? What supplies do we need? In this phase, there will be the temptation when things get a little bit tough to go back to phase one. Oh, let's climb a different mountain. And guess what happens? No mountains ever get climbed. So when you are in phase three of how are we going to climb this particular mountain, do not go back to phase one of brainstorming. And when you get those two mixed up, you'll find that you run in circles a lot. So phase one, which mountain? Phase two, that mountain. Phase three is tactical. How do we climb that mountain? And then phase four is let's put on our hiking boots and climb the mountain. So I hope this helps you when you're thinking through how are you going to climb? Which mountain are you going to climb? And then not switching back and going back to brainstorming once you've made a strong strategic decision. Good leading.